Kiora, Talafalava, Malele, Mbula, Aloha and welcome. Season 11, Episode 9 of Breakfast Mites by TevovoDigital.com. A wrap of Pacifica People's Sports News on Friday morning, 11 October 2024. Happy birthday, Tina Board. Coming to you with tons of Anisi from the 180th Meridian in the middle of the blue continent, where it is a muggy 22 degrees Celsius with 99% humidity at 5 a.m. this morning. In football, the Fiji Buller Boys scored a crucial 1-0 win against the Solomon Islands in the FIFA World Cup 2026 Oceania qualifier in Suva yesterday after captain Roy Krishna scored the winning goal in the 13th minute. PG played with 10 men from the 39th minute of the game after Aparosa Yanda received a red card. New Socceroos coach Tony Popovic. His debut was uh, sweet after enduring first half torture at Adelaide Oval. The Aussies are back on course for a sixth consecutive FIFA World Cup appearance after a come from behind 3 1 win over China before facing Japan away next. Tuesday. In rugby union, the most obvious next step, stemming from the recent outburst by senior Fiji water flying Fijians uh, players against the Fiji rugby union over allegations of corruption, incompetence, mismanagement and late player payments, is the need for the formation of a players union. In rugby league, Superstar playmaker Sean Johnson is coming out of retirement to replace Dally M winner Jerome Hughes for the Kiwis. Hughes was uh, initially named in New Zealand's 21-man squad for the Pacific Championships against Australia and Tonga, but he was ruled out yesterday with a neck injury. Johnson will revive his test career in the Kiwis' opening Pacific Championship game against Australia in Christchurch on 27 October. Coincidentally, it was at the same venue that Johnson played the last of his 32 tests in the Kiwis series winning 23-8 win over Great Britain in 2019. In the NFL, data released to ESPN shows NFL player arrests have been cut in half over the past decade. Since the case of Ray Rice, when in September of 2014, Video footage of the former Ravens running back savagely beating up his then fiance was released. The NFL handed Rice an indefinite suspension and changed its personal conduct policy to include severe punishments for domestic violence offenders. Finally in boxing, the Riyadh group made a huge effort for the uh, Artur Bibete Biv uh, versus Dmitry Bivol fight to take place in Saudi Arabia when many fans were asking for it to be held in Russia, despite the political situation in the country. It is estimated that each Russian warrior will earn US $10 million for this fight, no matter who wins or loses. And that's a wrap, uh, peeps. Please hit the like and subscribe buttons below if you want to receive more Pacifica sports highlights on Breakfast Bites. Mahalo and kakite for tableovodigital.com. I'm Carlton Khmer. Thanking you all too much for all your love and support.